The markets are pricing in about a 30% chance of a Fed rate hike later this Thursday. I don't know about you, but the thought of being here talking about the same thing next month in December, maybe even perish the thought next spring, doesn't exactly fill me with a great deal of excitement. Absolutely, and, and I think a lot of investors are growing tired of all this uh, weight and, and just the agony of this entire debate. Uh, and if it's not going to be September, then it's probably going to be October. And, and so to get it out of the way would actually be positive for, markets, for the markets. And that's also why we think that a hike could uh, see a positive effect. So we're back on sell on the rumour, buy on the fact. Be prepared for some sort of relief rally if we get something, anything of substance from the Fed. A relief rally would uh, first and foremost be, uh, be in emerging markets. That would be the first place that we'll be looking for. We'll be looking really across the board, of course, also in, in equities, uh, but in, in emerging market bonds. Uh, we have seen some, some build-up of, uh, of uh, what we call Fed fear, uh, this fear that uh, US dollar-denominated debt uh, could be in for a rough ride if, if rates would be, were to uh, rise aggressively. Uh, so, so I think if the market would be adopting a more softer or easier uh, stance towards this, uh, then, then certainly uh, emerging market bonds would benefit. So it's not just if we get a rate hike later. Key will be the tone of Janet Yellen's statement. Look for some sort of clues as to forward direction. What the market is, uh, would be afraid of is, is that we get aggressive uh, hikes and, and that's why we think that even if the Fed hikes, uh, it'll be, uh, the, the, the statement will, will be sure to, to, to calm the markets and make sure that uh, all, the, uh, all the hikes will be gradual, it'll be uh, very soft. So, uh, and, and if they do not do that, uh, then of course we, will see a, a, we could see an aggressive uh, risk-off uh, scenario.